Salute to the squad. Salute to the family. And we're going to start this video just like this. Doesn't it feel good when the right thing happens? Doesn't it feel good with what is supposed to happen happens? The righteous thing happens, man. And shout out to um, Sebastian Fondora's train, uh, trainer. I'm saying my bad, bro. Sebastian Fondora's promoter, Samson, man, went on to make a statement. We were also eager to make this fight that many of our agreements were made verbally, bro. So it was not on a signed piece of paper, it looks like. There wasn't enough time, but I wish to make it clear that Team Fondora will honor the agreement. My word is always equal to a signed contract. Tim Zhu, your rematch is ready when you are, man. And salute to Samson for being a stand-up guy. And salute to Samson for keeping his word, bro. Because our word is gold, man. Our word is bond. We always got to be a man of our word, bro. And I hope it does happen, man. I'm hoping and praying that Tim Zhu gets the rematch and gets his opportunity to take back his belts, man. Because at the end of the day, Tim Zhu agreed to fight Sebastian on a 12-day notice, gave him the opportunity, went in there, and basically, bro, I got to be honest, man. He was dog-walking Fondora for those first two rounds until he accidentally ran into that elbow at the end of the second round, got that big gash on top of his head, and they could not stop that bleeding to save their lives. And this man basically went on the fight, that fight with one eye, bro, because he was blind from the other. He was blind from the other. And I'm not trying to take nothing away from Fondora, man. Shout out to Fondora. Fondora fought with a broken nose from the second round. This dude was bleeding out his mouth. His nose was broken, messed up, bleeding out his nose, bro. And he fought all the way to the end, kept his distance, established his jab. Salute to him. He won, bro. But, um, and he was a, he's a tough guy, bro. But at the end of the day, I know that he knows. And in the back of his mind, it really has to bother him the way that he won, bro. I got to keep it a buck with my opinion. He knows that if Tim Zhu did not get that gash on top of his head, I'm going to tell you now, I feel like he would have stopped Fondora, bro. I feel like he would have stopped Fondora. And if the rematch does actually happen and Samson, you know, does stick to his word, I would not be surprised one bit if Tim Zhu goes on to stop Fondora, man. And what this means for Errol Spence, man, this just means tough luck, bro. You're out of luck on this one. You got to figure out your next move because, you know, Spence wanted to, you know, uh, fight Fondora after, you know, basically Terrence Crawford got blackballed again. But, um, you know, there's only one fight to make when it comes to Fondora, bro, and it's to make that Tim Zhu rematch. That's the only fight that makes sense at this point. And, you know, you could go ahead and prove all the doubters and, you know, and the non-believers wrong like myself, bro. Go ahead and prove me wrong. I'll go ahead and say I was wrong about you, bro, but I just do not see there's no way, no chance in hell that Sebastian Fondora would have beat Tim Zhu if he didn't get that gash on top of his head. There's no way in hell, bro. You got to think about it. This man won a split decision, barely squeaked out a victory with this dude being blind from one eye, bro. Think about that. Gushing out blood from the top of his head. That thing was coming out like a fountain, bro like a fountain, and he barely squeaked out the win. I mean, <clears throat> I hope the rematch does happen. I feel like both of them would make a ton of money, and those of us that didn't see that first fight, you better believe a lot of people will be tuning in for the rematch just because what an exciting fight the first one was and what a bloodbath that first fight was, man. So I'm hoping that Samson sticks to his word, and I'm hoping the fighters, you know, get in there and give us another show. I'm wishing, you know, both of them a speedy recovery because they both went to war that night. You know, I hope Tim Zhu's cut heals up well and we could get that rematch. And, you know, I can make some money because I'm a bet on the knockout and Tim Zhu gets an opportunity to take his belts back, bro. Uh, my thoughts, my opinions. What do you guys think about this rematch? Do you want to see a rematch? Uh, or would you rather see Sebastian Fondora fight Errol Spence, man? Let me know in the comments. Always like the video if you're rocking with the content. If you're not subbed. Please sub to the channel, bro. It helps us grow out here, man. Peace and blessings to all my real ones. We out of here.